viewers. Hello, lovely viewers. I welcome you to Omadez once again. And please, um, if you are new to the channel, you subscribe for more tutorials. And today I want us to learn how we can fill a test inside ships. Okay, how we can fill test inside ships. Okay, so first of all, let's say this is my ship. Okay, I will take um, ellipse. Okay, and draw ellipse. Okay, or a perfect circle or any shape. Okay, and this the tests that I'll be using. Okay, yeah. So once you've drawn it like this, then you copy your test. You copy your test. Okay. Okay, then you click on test two. Okay, then you come back here, please. Look at here very carefully. Um, I'll bring the test to around the ship like this. You see, you see this sign there. If you see this sign, it means if I paste in my test, it will go around the ship. Okay, it will go around the ship. By this time around, I want it to fill inside the ship, I'm not going around. Okay, yeah. So once you see it like this. You bring it inside a bit closer, a bit closer inside. Then it will tend to uh, let's say rectangular form like this. Okay. Then you click on. Okay. Yeah. Once it turns, then you click. Okay. Let's do it again. You take your test to. Okay. Yeah. Then you bring it around your ship, inside the ship. Then it will turn like this. Once it turns like this, then you click. Okay, as soon as you click, the whole thing will turn into a test box. Okay, within your ship. So, once it turns, it means it's ready to accept test. Okay, and remember, I've already copied my test. I've already copied my test. So, it's just a matter of you right click. Okay, then you paste. Okay, just like this. Yeah, just like this simple yeah so you can control it it has now become editable test so you can control it yeah from here yes it's very nice very nice very interesting very nice very interesting just like this okay yeah and once you get it like this okay once you get it like this you can remove the what do you call it the outline okay and it will still take the shape that you do. So let me remove your outline. You click on it and you come here. None. Okay, look. It has still taken the shape. Okay. Like this. It's very interesting. Very nice one. Good. Let me do another one again. Um let's me write um let's say yeah, writing with a love. Okay. Good. And stretch it then I find a bold test I want a bold test like this one good okay yeah, like this one here still remains on my desk please if you have any comment kindly drop it under the comment section and please kindly subscribe also for more tutorials okay good. once you get it like this okay then you come to object Okay, then you convert it to caves. Okay, you convert it to caves. Again, once you have typed your letter like this, come to object, convert it to caves, like this. Okay, then you click on this one here or here with a left click. We have a right click and a left click. Okay, on the bottom of your mouse, so you click on, okay, with the left click. That's the normal clicking bottom of your mouse, not the right one. And as soon as you click, see, okay. So it is there, but it has removed the fill, okay. So it's just a matter of giving it an outline. Then this time around, you right click. You put it on a the color, then you right click, okay. Any color that you put, any color that you right click on, it means that's the outline color. 
you see you right click not the left click the left click fill inside okay but if you put it here okay if you put it here and you and you left click it means you are removing the color and at the same place if you right click it means you are removing the outline okay good like this let me fill in color and show you i'll fill in the color then you right click on this sign it means i'm removing the color like this okay let me fill it again and this time around i'm left clicking it sorry if you fill in the color like this and you left click on this one you put a cursor on this one and you left click it means i'm removing the mm -hmm. color okay like this okay good let me fill it in again so if you select this one okay then this time around you right click at the same place okay yeah if you compare the bottom of your mouse you have left and right click so if you right click on this one it means i'm removing the outline and the left click remove the fill okay you see good so like what we were doing i remove the color then i give it an outline color or i give it an outline okay once i'm done like this uh, i'm deleting this one okay i've selected all this one okay with the help of this shape too i just want to create something better there once it's already converted to curve i can turn it to something else i want to turn this one to a love shape okay yeah so you delete this one and bring this one here and you click here double click here okay yeah like this sorry double click here then double click here then you do this okay yeah then do the same thing here double click and just constructing a love shape okay like this one okay click here hmm? I'm constructing a love shape yeah once you convert it to curve because remember i've already converted the whole thing to curves okay the whole test i've converted it to curves select over here and bring it down like this okay yeah yeah good yes the remains on my desk we are learning how to fill test in the shape okay good you see okay Okay, like this one. You see, this is my love shape. Let me select all with the help of shape two. Then, if you double click on any converted object, it will automatically activate this shape two. Okay, good. So, I'm bringing it down to take the level of this. Good. Now, we are still on how we can fill in a test within a shape. Okay. I've already done one example and I'm doing the second one. Okay, good. So I'm done like this. I will copy my test. Okay. I'll copy.
copy my text like this okay you right click then you copy then like i told you you click on test two and it's like the first one if you bring it outside like this it will turn to this sign meaning i'm failing my test outside the ship but i don't want it that way i want it to fill inside the ship okay so i'll bring it closer inside like this you see yes when it turns to this rectangular box it means it's ready to fill inside then you click and it automatically turn into a text box okay the whole shape will turn into a text box then you right click and paste in your test okay like this yes once you are done you can control it you can control it yes 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 still remains on my desk if you have any comment can you drop it under the comment section yes i can use this ship too to make it more compatible like this or make it closer like this okay good i don't want to leave any space in that is why i'm closing all the gaps yeah yes the room is on my desk Seems like the test is finished. I can still right click since the test is still active. Then I right, I right click and I paste it to fill another one. Good. That's what I did. Yes, still remains on my desk. If you have any comment, please drop it under the comment section. Good. So this is it. Okay. Now I can remove the outline like this, and I've already shown you. You put it on this one, then you right click. Okay. Good. It's gone uh, but it has already taken the ship like this okay good let me copy one and fill in the color because i fill in the color i click on the color it has it has affected all the test so it's just a matter of Selecting all the test you click on then you press ctrl E Meaning I've selected all the tests then you give it a color like this You have this in Yeah, like this Yeah, very interesting very nice one Good So viewers that is the end of how you can fill a test in a ship. Please, if you have any comment, kindly drop it under the comment section. And please subscribe for more tutorials. Thank you and enjoy this video. Bye.